Hey guys, it's Nikki with This Robin's Nest here. So in today's video, I'm gonna show you a yard sale find, which I don't think I ever shared with you guys before. And this is like a vintage kind of mail slot, I guess. It must have been used at a business or some kind of office. I'm not really sure. Let me get in close. Take a look at this, you guys. It has the nameplate still for all the slots. It looks like some people um, shared their slots. So I was using this in my office for, and I paid $20 for this at a yard sale locally um, at a neighbor's house. And they had really, really cool stuff. Um, but this is the only thing that I bought because their items were a little on the higher price side for a yard sale for me. But this was a piece where I was like, I'm not gonna come across that again. And it's really chippy, kind of like this gray blue color. There's Max, hi Max. <laughs> and so yeah, I was using it in my office for sorting my bills as they would come in. I alphabetized them and then I would just put them in the slots. But I think I'm going to use this in my dining room. So stay tuned and I will show you um, how I use it. So I thought I would show you guys my dining room because that's where I'm going to be using the um, yard sale find. And it's, well, let's see, I'll get back up here a little bit. It's got this little um, kind of archway and then you go in here. It's not big enough for like a long, big table, but this round one fits pretty good. And you can see I have my $3 pitcher from Target Dollar Spot with some floral, that's some um, artificial floral in there. And then I also have these little bunny napkin rings that were from the Target Dollar Spot. And over here, I have this cabinet with my milk glass collection on it. And it also has a wooden banner from Target Dollar Spot <laughs> that says smile. And you guys can just kind of see my collection here. And this is probably um, my favorite piece is this bird on a nest, which I absolutely am in love with. Um, and then I have some different pieces scattered throughout the house. Now let me show you um, in this corner over here, I have um, two more yard cell finds. If you guys have probably seen in a previous video. And then I have this little bubble gum machine that I found at the Goodwill. I got it for like $7.99 and I just spray painted it. So like a baby blue and then a cream. And I was going to use it in my office and fill it with like washi tape or something decorative. It's not for candy anymore um, because it's painted. I painted it so it's not really food safe, but I think it's a really cute decorative piece. So let me show you guys how I put the yard cell find to use. So there is the dining room table and then you guys can see over here is the um, mail slot. And I have a book by Tori Spelling called Celebratory. And then as you scroll down, um, I will add more stuff, but just to give you guys an idea for the use, there's coasters in the top, some linens, napkins, um, flatware, napkin rings, um, these, these ones right here are like a silver floral napkin ring are really pretty. I haven't used them yet. Oh, and there's one of my dollar spot pens my daughter <laughs> probably put in there. Um, but yeah, so it's really fun because it even still has the names on it. I love that. And I was using it for my bills and now I'm using it in my dining room. You guys will have to tell me um, what you think about the repurpose of this mail slot cabinet and I will see you guys in the next video. I hope you have a great week. Bye.